Welcome back to another episode of The Space, a mindfulness podcast that's not like the others. I'm your host, Casey Donovan. Alongside Amy Malloy, we use every Thursday to talk all about you and explore mindfulness tips to help you be your best self. How do you feel when you say this statement? You are enough. It sounds like a cliche from a cheerleading mum, but it's a shame that most of us don't believe it. Experts are warning the craziness of last year can impact on our self-esteem. Any kind of upheaval can hit our self-confidence. You don't have to walk around loving yourself sick, but imagine waking up feeling like you're good enough, even if it's just good enough. It can be particularly difficult to make sense of the world and yourself in this COVID-altered space. These feelings can easily affect your sense of self and your relationship with others. This is according to Dr. Dev Roy Chowdhury, a researcher and consultant in mindfulness, mental health and performance psychology. So, how can mindfulness help us? Tip 1. Schedule a reminder on your phone. Let's say for 10pm every night, says Dr. Dev. Keep the reminder simple. I am enough. When you see the reminder flash on your mobile screen, mindfully repeat the statement to yourself. Remind yourself that what you have done today is enough. As you do this, calmly take a deep breath in, he advises. Hold it for a few brief moments and then let it out. Make it part of your regular bedtime routine. Tip two, dedicate a few moments every day to look at the clouds. It's simple but effective, he says. As you stare at the sky, notice how the clouds move. See how they differ in sizes and shapes. Realise the clouds are neither rushing to go anywhere or trying too hard to make a certain shape. They simply are. It's the same for you. You are different, but unique. You're not too late, or too early. You are happening right now, exactly as you're meant to be. It might sound like a cheesy thing to do, but watching the clouds can be super soothing. At the very least, it will force you to pause. So, go on, get your head in the clouds and love yourself more. I'm Casey Donovan and you've been listening to The Space. Tune in tonight for another mood-shifting topic. How that thing you're dreading is messing with your schedule and how to cope with it better. Until then, space out. Thank you.